El Toro is having a new week track, which is its second week track because of an incident within two years. So in this video, I will be addressing it and talking about my thoughts on the week track. This is why El Toro will never be the same after the week track. Enjoy. <laughs> El Toro at Six Flags Good Adventure had an accident somewhat recently, where near the end of the ride, people from the train said their backs felt really bad and that they had really bad aches. So those people were rushed to the hospital so a doctor could check to see if there were any major injuries. So after Six Flags heard about that, they decided to retract El Toro. So far, what we've seen is that there's pieces from the draw missing and at the bottom of the first turnaround and that they had the cable wired up at the beginning of the lift. Why this is so convenient is because, correct me if I'm wrong, but those are the same spots that they retracked after Otoro's last incident. Now, let's get to why I think Otoro will never be the same. Now, this is about to get sad, so brace yourselves. But I feel like Otoro will never be the same because it already had two incidents in back-to-back -back years. So I feel if it has one more incident in 2023 or 2024 that El Toro will end up closing permanently because I feel like the park will end up feeling like El Toro had too many incidents or El Toro is becoming a safety hazard, etc. I know it's sad but it's true in my opinion so. Give me your thoughts. Will El Toro be good as new, like we will never see incident on El Toro ever again, or will El Toro close? If you made it to the end of the video, comment save El Toro, and also consider subscribing since I make very high quality rollercoaster content. I'm Horizon Thirds, and I'll see you guys on the horizon. Peace.